Hey, what's up guys? Purple Junior here. Today we have my 100 subscriber special. My car is insane. And this is my, my Q&A. And I have a bunch of questions from you guys. Which I am going to answer. I'm trying not to, I'm trying not to make this too. I'll try not to blabber on and rant on about each question too long. I'll try to make it a bit, a bit shorter. So these are in a completely random order. So starting we have, of course, we have... Is you missed a fashion killer asking, can you buy me MVP plus? No. If you buy it for me, maybe. Maybe. That's a maybe. So there you go. There's your answer fashion. We have Jorgen asking, why do you have a glass hat? Which is also asked by John Yeard. He's like, why do you have glass on your head? I have to say swag. You know, swag. If you don't, you, the glass hat just it gives you swag. You need to put that bad boy on. If any of you know how to. I don't know if any of you know how to, it's not hard. Put, a, put one of those bad boys on your head, and you will feel the swag. You'll feel it. Bacon Strips asks, What was your reaction when you first created Helper on Hypixel? How about mod? Well, I have to say it's awesome. Like, applying for Helper, it's really competitive. There's loads of people going for it, and if you get accepted, it just it makes you feel like you are apart from the crowd. It makes you feel... Like, you impress people, which is kind of human nature to make you feel good if you impress people. Um, how about mod? That's kind of, it's kind of even bigger. Like, when you get promoted from anything, it makes you, it makes you realise that people, people knew you were doing a good job. And that's also, like, it just makes you feel good. Going a bit too deep there. Sorry about that. Ponj Martin asks, who did you first meet on YouTube? Well, I'm going to kind of say half and half here. Half being official first person was an old ch on an old channel that I had with friends, which I'll probably talk about later in the video. Who was He was called Luke. The channel was called The Gnome. He was an awesome guy to record with. Sadly, he doesn't record anymore, so I can't record with him on this channel. But Luke, really cool guy. Kind of more official on this channel, though, is through the last channel, actually, Drinkable Trees. Drink, I was the first person I met, and him in fashion were the first two that I recorded with on the old channel, which was just me at that time on the old channel. That that one recording, the one time it was just me, it was with those two. And I still record with them now, which is freaking awesome. The next question is Anti Panty who asks, Why are you so OP? Um Well, you know, it just it just comes with it's the glass head, you know? Get that get that swag going and you get the G O P. The the Fear X Blaze he likes to be known. The Fear X Blaze asks for one, why do you smell? Well, you know, man, when you've got this glass head on, you start building up a sweat. When you start beating beating all the noobs. Second question is, Wow did you meet me? Lil. Assuming it means how. GG bro, nice type of skills. How? Um Fear kind of half met through Fear is a bit of, I assume most people know, Fear is a bit of a Wolves pro, and kind of met him through both playing Wolves a bit too much. Well, more me than him, not going to make him sound as bad as me here, but we both played Wolves a lot, so we kind of just played together through that, and half drink and fashion, like being friends with Fear. Half and half, met him through them, and Fear, yeah, he's alright, you know, I'm joking, man, you're cool. Super Dan 109 asks, how did you find out about the Hypixel network? Um, I remember I found out through a Google search looking for uh wall servers, and I searched it because I've been looking for ages. There is not many wall servers that are good. Um, I searched it when I saw Hypixel, like I recognized the name, official person who made the map, and I tried out the server, and that's how I found it way back in the day when the walls, uh, <laughs> walls, not Mega Walls, Walls leaderboard was like fifteen wins to be first place. That was a while ago now. Um, next bit is both asked by John the Id and Nick1304 is well John asks what is your head and Nick asks what's it like being a potato so kind of what is my skin um, well Nick as he said why what's it like being a potato I kind of adapted to being a potato because lots of people thought when I made my skin it wasn't anything it was completely random just random texture and then Nick I believe was probably the first person that said you look like a potato and I just kind of stuck with that because I had no other thing to call it. But recently in a Skype call, 
skips films, shout out to him for having this amazing perception of my skin, said, I look like a teddy bear on meth, which I, I, didn't, I didn't know what to say to, but that, that's beautiful. A teddy bear on drugs, and I'm not entirely sure which one I prefer, to be honest. They're both pretty cool. Teddy bear, though, uh, I know Jags, to him, he, he kind of loved that. He got a bit excited when he heard that. Um, well, John and Nick both have more questions here. So, John, he, these are both both of them ridiculous questions. John asks, "Why is the sky blue?" Um, because reasons, you know, reasons. That's there's your answer. Reasons. John also asks, "Do you prefer green grapes or red grapes?" Random, but green grapes all the way, man. It's all about green grapes. Green apples over red apples. Green grapes over red grapes. He then asks, why did you start YouTube? Which, well, I believe someone else asks that. Basically, me and my friends on the old channel, that was my first channel, and after our exams last year, we had a two and a half month summer holiday off. And with two and a half months, with not a lot to do, you kind of get bored. So two of the four of us, I think, recently got good computers. So we decided to start recording together because we we thought it'd be more fun to have the four of us who made a channel. It was OH Sharp Z, Potts, and Mr. Cool Dude, and a me. And that was the first channel. And that lasted quite a while. That's why I met some of the other guys that I've spoken about. And then Mr. Cool Dude kind of kind of stopped. He didn't want to do it anymore. So we thought rather than carrying on with just the three of us, it would be easier to start solo channels. So that's how I came to have this channel and all of you guys. Yay! And then Nick, some of Nick's questions, here's a few more. He asks, why am I so awesome? Uh, Nick, you're not awesome. Sorry, man. You're just, you're just not awesome. He also asks, what happens if you lose your glass bowl? Because he thinks it's a bowl, that's what he says. And you lose the swag, man, as I spoke about. You lose the swag. If you don't have a glass bowl, you don't have the swag. That's how it works. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Potts, um, Potts asks... How did or do friends and players respond to the name Puffle Jr.? Well, it kind of varies, to be honest. Most guys, well, the people that know me, I'm just Puff or Puffy, which is actually fine. But I've had quite a few strange, strange names. I've had Fluffy Bulls, which is just terrible. I, I don't even, and that can just then lead to very distasteful names if the person isn't a very polite person, and it, it doesn't make me feel good. Bulls just on its own, that's just terrible. Junior, that's a bit, that's an uncommon one, which is good. Um, puffy, let's, let's stick with Puffy, I like Puffy, I don't like Bulls or Fluffy Bulls or Hairy Bulls, no, none of that, none of that. Oh god, moving on, next question, Mega Ackman asks, why aren't you a mod anymore? Um, I get asked this a lot on the, on the server and I feel fear, we just, he just loves that freaking question. Um, basically, I have, it's like, real life stuff that I just... I had to sort out and priorities and I just needed to mod is stuff is really fun but it's time consuming and I just needed to sort stuff out in real life basically. Next question is kind of a combo. Pike Pixie, I'm oh, sorry, Pike, so that's just what I called you right from the beginning. Pixie asks, Who's your biggest inspiration? And Jags asks, any role models? So they I'm kinda of gonna mush those two questions together and I'm gonna to relate it to YouTube just to make a bit more sense. Um the first one, I kind of have two. The first one is kind of the the one that makes the biggest difference, um, which is Bayesian Canadian or Mitch. He, I've been wa I was watching Mitch since about two years ago, probably now, and he's kind of the reason that I play the mini games I do, like PvP, rather than being a survival channel or any crap like that. He, from watching way back in the day when he was playing with like Pete. Newt, Jerome, Phallus Moon, playing like Battle Dome and Catch the Wall and stuff like that. They were the ones, mainly Mitch, because he was a perspective I watched, the ones that made me want to play PvP. Watching them, how good they were, was the reason that I wanted to play PvP so much and looked for servers like Hypixel to play it on. So Mitch, is those guys are kind of the reason that I play so much PvP. They're the reason I just love it. It's way... I just love pvp it's the funnest part of minecraft in my opinion and then the second one is is kind of a more like quality kind of point of view which is hat films um the reason they are is because from the point of view of a youtube channel they 
they just kind of do everything right in my opinion their their content their commentary and their content is just hilarious they just they just kind of three guys that manage to make anything funny and then along with that like the editing they're kind of they're so professional their editing their artwork their thumbnails everything they do is professional which as a small youtuber is something that everyone would want to aspire to be like which is why i love their that's why they're an inspiration to me and a role model um i then have olive golden olive asks what kind of sushi you love the best i can't say i i ever want to have sushi i can't say it appeals eating raw fish it's just like slimy and oh I, I, i'm sorry i'm sorry if i offend you by saying that olive but i, I don't like sushi um zetha 47 asks what is your best youtube moment which I had to think about for a while, but I had to say the first Hunger Games, the Hunger Games, I believe episode four, saying I'm back, or don't quote me on that, I might be wrong. And when I uploaded that after about two or three months of not uploading, the response I got back was just incredible. And how fast we've grown is just absolutely insane. And that that has to be the best moment. The, the Like one or two days after that upload and seeing the response was just so good. That has to be my best moment. Um, Barca Slaps asks, why are you so puffy? Uh, I, I, I don't even know, man. It's just, it's just natural. It comes natural. As soon as I, as soon as I come along, just the puffy just enables. It's just, I don't, I have no idea what the hell I'm saying. I don't know why I'm so puffy. Just YOLO swag. That's my answer. Um, I think, oh, we have Nick Till, Itty. I'm so sorry about the pronunciation of that. It's probably completely wrong. But he has a few questions, and he asks, for one, is how many hacks do you have? Uh, over 9,000. He asks, how old are you? Um, I am 16. There you go. Key information right there. He asks, oh, this is just as good. Why do I like pizza? I don't know if he's asking, why does he like pizza, or why do I like pizza? Why you like pizza? I have no idea. Why I like pizza? Well, this could just be such a long conversation. There's multiple reasons why everyone likes pizza. You just can't not like it. If you don't like it, I don't mean offense. Moving on. He asks, his last question is, how did you get good at PvP? Um, kind of just playing so much that just kind of trial and error. You try different things with practice. Kind of PvP is very much practice makes perfect. You play it enough and you're going to get good just straight away. Just kind of learn how to do it oh god most people watching a pvp channel are probably pretty good to be honest so i'm sure most of you know and here we have the last question the last question of the q a which is uh, oh, there's five people who all asked this question i'm going to disappoint everyone it's asked by bacon strips xp nothing xp mega Ahmed, nick hill and john the id all of them asked basically how i got my name particle jr and I'm going to have to disappoint all of you by saying that I honestly do not remember. I I, remember, I made Puffle Jr. That name came, I made it on like the first Xbox Live account back when I was about 11 or 12. So four or five years ago, I've been Puffle Jr. I've used it on every single game. I have, I honestly don't remember where it came from. Where on earth I got Puffle Jr. Where, I have no idea where I got those different bits from. But I remember buying my Xbox Live gold premium card thingy majiggy and before even having bought it i knew puffle jr as soon as i verified the card puffle jr typed it in and pressed ok without a second thought it's just i don't know man puffle jr is just i have no idea where it came from it's completely random i'm sorry if that it well it doesn't answer your question at all so i'm sorry sorry to disappoint you well they they are all the questions that I got from Twitter and YouTube. So thank you to all of you guys who sent in a question. That's really cool of you. And at the end of this, really quick, I just want to say a few thank yous to some people that have kind of helped, well, completely helped me get to 100 subs. Um, I'm going to start from the beginning, the people from a few months ago when I recorded, and from the old channel, but kind of a bit of both. Just a really quick one, just because I feel I should. So... Oh, Sharpsy, Mystical Dude 347, Potts, and Benny Dudes. Just a quick thank you to those guys. I hope hope we can get a recording with you guys again. Introduce you again. And more, kind of more importantly, other people that I've recorded with recently. 
the guys that are basic they they're active oh god i don't even know how to begin basically drinkable trees miss fashion killer clear x blaze i'm jags i'm ashon ashon ashwan i can call you ashon just because all of those guys that i have recorded with recently are just they they're freaking awesome i knew drink and jag drink and jag i don't even know drink and fashion since before and fear half new and then i met jags and ashon ashon seeing them keep that i met them through through those guys and they're freaking awesome all of them i love recording with them they all have awesome channels they're all gonna be in the description definitely check them out because those guys have 100 percent helped me get where we are now and i really want to keep recording with them they're so fun to play with i think that's all i wanted to say about them thanks to those guys personal thank you you guys are awesome um and i believe that is that's a wrap as some might say for this 100 sub special so a personal thank you to all of you guys watching it is awesome to be doing this i have no intention of stopping so thanks simple thank you all right well guys i hope you enjoyed this leave me some support because this is a freaking this is an awesome video it's a huge deal on my channel and i will see you in the next video see ya